water signs welcome back to the channel with me OU with another tarot card message for you today we're using a right away tarot to pull in some messages from spirit see what energies are currently surrounding you what's coming towards you what's the advice what's the therapeutic session glad you're here like share subscribe add value to the channel so that we can continue to put out more and more tarot messages as the tribe grows we got a jumper, the queen of wands, an athlete here, content creator, possibly a VIP here. Someone, yeah, very creative. They're very confident as well. Strong fire sign energy grounding you, yeah. Someone that walks in victory here. This could be a celebrity. Mm -hmm. Or someone is very sexually attracted to you here. They're looking at you as the Queen of Wands. They're wanting to put you on some sort of a pedestal. They're wanting to be your sidekick here with the black cat. <laughs> right? Lady Luck. I wonder what would be the man version of Lady Luck. Yeah, one down. That's the first one I had to kill all day. We had the Eight of Pentacles. Hmm. Someone hard at work, maybe trying to get your attention, or this could be someone at work. King of Wands. Ooh, ain't even wait long for that to come out. <laughs> you might want to watch who. So I think the the Twin Flames came out in I think one of the first two readings. It wasn't the Air Sign readings. It was either the, Air, the uh, Aries or the Taurus reading. But yeah, these videos are relatively short today because I came out late. I was uh, lally gagging and being lazy. You know, the, the procrastinators of the world. But yeah, someone's either working very hard to come towards you or this could be someone that um, you're working with that you may be sitting directly across from. This message is getting very specific. I don't know, it's like you watch the back of each other's head. But this is positivity, you know. But I don't know. Whoa. This is positivity. Oh, there's a lot of uh, talking. This could be going back and forth. This usually talks about arguing. This could be date, debating as well. Or this could be one of those new age conversations where people don't like to ask people other questions. Some questions and people don't like people to... How does it... Certain questions shouldn't be asked, but how could that be? How, how could you put in that eight of pentacles to make a union work here? We have the queen of wands and the king of uh, wands. And this seems very um, interesting here. Yeah. That's two down. Well, there goes that. Go figure. Um, but yeah, again, this could be someone at work. We have a lot of pentacles energy here. There could be some rule about dating. Page of Swords that's possibly spying on you. Or this could be people spying on you guys, keeping track of you. Mm -hmm. Three of Swords. Not enough attention here. Now, this could be cheating amongst a union. Again, that, that karmic shit, you know, always feeling like, I don't know if I want to take it to the next level, so I'm just going to cheat or do something to sabotage the relationship. Like, people don't even ask themselves a second question about these things. But again, do what you will. Be free. Be free to make as many mistakes as you think you're afforded at the age that you're at. Hopefully, you'll, you that you'll get a second chance. And karma just doesn't come and swipe what you have away from. We have the Ace of Pentacles. Finance is a windfall. This could have been indeed a, a relationship commitment or a marriage. Possibly a business as well. This could be a lot of performance actors. Let's see. Six of Cups. Damn. This could be an apology. Someone coming towards you. Again, this is my um, spiritual flirtation card. This could have been like sleeping with someone's family member or something like that. I'm not sure why I'm getting that message. Hermit dealing with a Virgo. Possibly. Mm, someone could possibly be focused on work as well. Okay. So it's a little bit more clear though. Of course you want to come into a relationship. Three of Pentacles. Uh, already building something. Uh, eight of Pentacles. So you go from the three to the eight, then you have an ace, which is commitment. This is abundance, but it's also marriage here, a union. But then we also have the three of swords here. So some scolding is, um, I 
guess, do or hear. Or there's about to be some scolding. Marriage counseling or something like that. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, possibly a breakup. The ending of some sort of a cycle. I think I'll pull too many messages. <laughs> Let's see what the last one is. Ten of Pentacles. Hmm. There's a lot of money and finances there. Or this could be what's being affected. But I see a lot of abundance coming towards you. This is indeed a twin flame union. This is just regular mundane shit. Possible outside distractions. Three of swords. Other people hating on what you guys have. Because they don't have it. Again. Why you convince people. Why, why are people letting people convince them to. Their own taste. Convince them against their own tastes. Like your own taste in food. Your own taste in men or women. Or your own taste in movies and music. Like we share. We don't force shit down people's throats. <laughs> like okay. But that's what I have here. A lot of abundance. Uh, a lot of vibes. This could be some sort of a family function as well. The hermit. Yeah a private event. Again some sort of a family function here. I mentioned uh, having sex with someone's family member. But that just could be a bunch of family BS. Who knows? You know where you uh, resonate in that. Like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel. Water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Hopefully you enjoyed. Deuces.